The season 2010 is a very special one for the Salzburg Festival because it's the 19th anniversary and uh, of the beginning of the festival. And many of the ideas and projects that uh, made the, uh, the, yes, the history and the, the, the famous story of this festival uh, were born here in, in Leopoldskron. And many people say the biggest production uh, that lasts over 18 years and was uh, the most expensive one uh, was this castle uh, for Max Reinhardt. He, he produced uh, a big play and this play was his own life. And uh, this artificial uh, production of uh, what reality can be was in the same time a great Midsummer Night's Dream. This was the play he did um, very often in his career as a director. And uh, many things who are really important for his life and his work are aspects of the Midsummer Night's Dream. So I think the way he mixed dream and reality, uh, myth and uh, contemporary experiences this is uh, something that is a part of the big production that he realized in this park, with this castle, uh, with this environment he developed in this 18 years. You know, um, Reinhard did the Everyman in, uh, in a public place and uh, on the beginning was this risk and uh, it uh, was dangerous for many, many years and seasons before the Festspiel created this alternative uh, place, the, the, the big Festspiel house. But um, also Max Reinhardt produced many times uh, the Midsummer Night's Dream, for example, also in California, uh, but also here in Schloss Klesheim, uh, in public gardens. Uh, with the audience uh, that is walking through the environment from place to place. And uh, what we did, we learned that we need an alternative space here in Salzburg for the rainy days. And uh, so we found in the gardener's uh, glass house uh, a very beautiful place. I'm convinced that uh, Max Reinhardt would appreciate this environment extremely. I think we will continue uh, and uh, the structure works. Uh, so for the rainy weather we have this um, uh, second place to perform and uh, all the equipment, everything is uh, well made for both locations. And uh, I think uh, this is the first step and uh, we will do next year the next one and uh, I feel encouraged that this decision was right. If you see how many people wish to be a part of this production and to be uh, on this location, uh, involved in this very specific experience, I think this is something that only Festspiel can offer. And we are re really uh, happy about this collaboration with the Salzburg Global Seminar because uh, it's a part also of the history of uh, the, the seminar and it helps because uh, we build a bridge to art, we build a bridge to the city, we build a bridge to the public and, uh, and we create also a very good image for the work of the academy here in the summer um, because it's a part of this big cultural project and uh, I think uh, it's a good experience and also uh, on the rainy days the people enjoyed our Midsummer Night's Dream and this is what I want.